How to customize the conforming nose bridge. Your Tanbin cloth face mask comes with either a twist tie or metal piece inserted into the open nose bridge slot. While most people find the included piece to work for them, some folks may want to experiment with different materials to customize the fit of their mask. Customers have told us they've used the double wire twist ties from copy bags, copper wire, plastic or metal pieces purchased off Amazon, pipe cleaners, and or even aluminum foil to customize the nose bridge on their mask. Because the nose bridge slot on our mask is open, you can customize your mask for the ideal fit based on your unique face shape. It also means you can replace your nose bridge piece if it breaks or fails without needing to buy a new mask. Ways to reduce or prevent glasses from fogging. Many folks find that their glasses don't fog when wearing our masks. We think that's because the included nose bridge material works for them. If you find that your glasses are fogging, we'd first suggest trying different nose bridge materials. Make sure the nose bridge is pressed to conform to your nose. Rest your glasses just over the edge of the mask. Breathe through your nose instead of through your mouth. Need more tips to avoid glasses fogging? We like this article from the website All About Vision, linked below. One easy fix that they recommend is to wash your glasses lens in soapy water and air dry. The soap leaves a thin film that may prevent fogging. Adjusting the ear loops. To adjust the ear loops on our mask, give them a gentle tug. For a better fit, we recommend wearing the ear loops as snug as is comfortable for you. Looser ear loops will result in a looser fit. Using the lanyard. We find the neck lanyard to be a convenient feature when we go out for walks. If other people aren't around, we can let the mask hang around our neck and against the sternum. If we see another person coming our way, it's easy to quickly grasp the ear loops without touching the fabric of the mask and put the mask on. For us, this is much better than our previous method of stuffing a mask in our pocket, which resulted in a lot more handling of the mask. Some folks may want to adjust their ear loops when they're ready to put their mask back on. We think this is a good thing because it helps remind us to make sure our mask is well fitted on our face. Adjusting your mask for a better fit and seal. Following the tips we shared about customizing the conforming nose bridge and adjusting the ear loops are our top two tips on improving fit. Another important tip would be to make sure you're wearing the right size mask. This is a V4 in medium large. It's a little too big for my face. This is a V4 in small medium. Your mask should cover your nose and mouth and not slip off during normal talking. How to feel cooler, temperature folks, while wearing a mask. We're continually testing masks new fabrics, new designs. What's the number one way we've discovered that we can improve the comfort of any mask? Paying attention to our breathing. We've discovered that when we're stressed, we're likely to breathe rapidly and shallowly. More breaths equals more heat being released. We've also noticed that when we take shallow breaths instead of deep breaths, we don't feel like we're getting as much oxygen as we need. We've also found that breathing through our mouths instead of through our noses definitely increases the feeling of heat and moisture in a mask. We liked this article in the New York Times on masks and healthy breathing, linked below. We also found these breathing exercises which encourage deeper, slower breaths to be very helpful, also linked below. This is what worked for us and it might be different for you. As always, please consult your personal physician on any matters related to masks, breathing, or health. Ways to wash and dry your mask. 
We recommend following the CDC instructions for washing a cloth face mask. Per CDC instructions as of October 2020, you can either hand wash and line dry, preferably in the sun, or machine wash and machine dry on the warmest setting appropriate for the fabrics. And it's okay to wash your mask with your other laundry. We recommend washing your masks in a mesh laundry bag so the ear loops and lanyard don't get caught on other stuff, which may cause it to break. Shaping your mask after you wash it and before line drying or immediately after the dryer cycle ends will help reduce wrinkles. It's up to you whether you remove the nose bridge material prior to washing, but doing so will likely help it last longer. Two methods for removing the lanyard. While most folks prefer our masks with lanyards, some may want to remove that feature. If that's you, the good news is that it's very easy. Method 1. Remove lanyard and keep adjustability of ear loops. Method 2. Remove lanyard and permanently fix length of ear loops. Will your mask last forever? Your Tombin face mask will last quite a while, even longer if you use a mesh wash bag so ear loops don't get caught on stuff. But it won't last forever. That said, we're still using the very first mask we made for ourselves back in March. What does last forever? The fact that we're all in this together. Everything that connects us means we're never alone even if we feel alone sometimes. Wearing a mask reminds us that we're all in this together. By wearing a mask, any brand of mask, we're taking care of ourselves, our friends, family, community, and country. Thanks to you guys, we've donated over 150,000 face masks to healthcare workers, tribal nations, environmental nonprofits, food banks, and elderly housing, amongst other communities.